Oh, here we go. This is a transparent female mask, the same one Sean used at the beginning of 2009 for, well, touring a deep mask. This is actually three masks all piled on top of each other because they are a little bit warped and out of shape, so hopefully they'll get it back. As you can see it's making them a little bit pinkish, like Sean's red version. Um, the eye cuts aren't cut properly, they're a little bit small. Um, blue paint job and the cheeks look a lot darker than they actually are. This is quite a small mask, my chin doesn't fit properly in it. But it's definitely one of my favourites of Sean's and I have on quite a lot of Sean's replica masks and this is one of the versions I want to keep so since I've got, I've got four copies and three of them are here I might keep one as the original and do a normal clear version a black version and a red version I haven't decided yet here's my clear version. It isn't fully clear in person actually, but the camera appears to be a little clear. I remove, and I remove some of the black paint underneath the eyes. There's um, one of the earliest pictures of Sean's during 2009. It doesn't look like there's any black paint underneath. This before he put black underneath the mask and way before he got the chip on the tooth. So there isn't any colourless colour in that set. I also enlarged eyes a little bit, I was having difficulty seeing through them. And they don't look like the same size as Sean, so I cut them a little bigger. 